friends! Welcome or welcome back to my channel! My name is Sasha and today we are continuing the 25 days of Christmas here on my channel. I hope it brings you some joy and some happiness this holiday season. I know I needed more of that so I'm trying to put it out into the universe and share it with all of you. Before we do get started, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe here on my channel and my videos. It does really help out and I always appreciate talking to you guys down in the comments below. I am very excited for the video we're going to watch today. It is a video of Luna doing All I Want For Christmas Is You as a cover on one of the music shows. Because of that, the editing might be a little bit weird to try and get this video up and out to you all in a proper manner. I hope you know what I'm trying to say without directly saying it. Uh, but yes, I am so excited. This is a Christmas song that I can bop along to pretty much any time of the year because I just, I really like this song. And I'm really excited to see what they do with this. Um, their outfits, just from the thumbnail alone, look amazing. I had very similar costumes when I was on the dance team in high school for Christmas. Ours was the red velvet, but it was all long sleeves with the right uh, fringe around the bottom and the sleeves. So, I just had a very weird high school flashback. We're gonna be watching Luna's All I Want For Christmas Is You, so sit back, relax, get some hot chocolate, if you drink that, uh, hot tea, hot coffee, anything hot, because I'm a little cold. Here we go. Oh my god, they look great! They sound great. Oh. This is my first time seeing Luna do like fun choreography. Christmas is you. Oh my god, such a classic dance step. <laughs> Oh my gosh! I love the choreography! <laughs> oh, it's so adorable! Okay, we went from adorable to mean girls really quick. <laughs> I love that all of their outfits are just a little bit different. That's so fun. Their boot heights are different too. Whoa, nice. They sound so good. I know I already said that. It's just true. Me thinking they're about to do a kick line because they got into a line. Oh man.
Okay, anyway, BTS, thank you for the commercial. That was adorable. Like, how dare they? You know how something's so cute, you just want to, like, squish it? Oh my gosh, they're so cute. That was so much fun. That put me right in the holiday spirit. I love the costumes. I love that they're all altered a little bit differently. I love that they have different like hair accessories. I love that the boots are different heights. I thought all of that was so nice and a great way to individualize each member and sort of highlight maybe personalities. I don't know if they had any say in what they got to pick in terms of accessories. Um, I think the Space Buns girl is my favorite in this performance. She just like crushed me every time. She's so adorable. I just, I loved it. The, they sounded so good, uh, like incredible. I think they were probably singing live. Um, that is my assumption. I'm not good at being able to tell if people are lip syncing or not, and I don't really care. Um, but I, they sounded so good regardless whether they pre-recorded it or sang it live. They sound great. The choreography, I think I mentioned that this was the first time I had seen choreography this fun from them, and I don't mean that they aren't having fun performing um, like their other choreography. I just mean this is more relaxed and laid back, and it's not taken as seriously as like some of their other choreography might be. There's a lot of really classic like grapevine and hip um like hip bouncing and like all sorts of stuff that is so classic you just pull it out to pull together a really quick holiday dance and it worked so well for them i thought it made them look adorable but we all know like the talent that they have that they can absolutely crush the stage if they needed to but they didn't need to in this they just crushed us with cuteness ha <sighs> I loved it. <laughs> I also wanted to mention, I think the choreography is a little more um, simplified here. For the season, it matches really well with just like general Christmas. And then also because this time of year for K-pop artists is insane. Uh, with all of the award shows and end of the year shows and Christmas and New Year's Eve and like Literally, I think I counted it last year for Stray Kids, and they did 20 different versions of God's Menu in three months. So I can only imagine what Luna was doing on top of learning this entire song, on top of learning all the choreography for this song, what else they were performing pretty much on a daily basis. So I give them major props for even, like, performing this at the level that they did. I thought it was great. Like, it's honestly the cutest thing I have seen so far this season. I am so happy I watched it. I hope with the quality that you were able to watch it with me and that it doesn't look too weird or funky. Um, I hope I was able to get it up on screen for you guys to watch too. So that was Luna's All I Want for Christmas is You. I enjoyed it so much. I hope you did as well. We should have one more Luna video during this 25 days of Christmas, so I hope you look forward to it. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you and your family are safe and healthy this holiday season. I'll see you next time. Bye!